Hello everyone, it's March Cherrygate here. It's been a little while, but I thought that I would pop in here with a little June barn vlog. So, first thing, since the summer months have been getting a bit warmer, I've been getting up early and riding Flash before work, and today I took him down to Marley's farm to do some jumping. So after Flash is done, we've hacked back to the stables. It's time to give Flash, Bramble, Clover, and Ariel all breakfast. So I go ahead and make Bramble and Clover's hay nets and toss Flash his hay. I also make sure to put on Flash and Bramble's fly masks, although Clover's already has hers on. Then it's time to take both boys out into the field for the day. So you all may have noticed a bit of a change of scenery and a new horse. I'll address the change of scenery first because I finished my studies at Silverglade University. So I'm officially graduated from there which means that I needed to find a new place to board my horses because I could not afford the expenses of Silverglade. So I moved to a barn outside the city and it's a DIY yard. So basically you do everything for your horses yourself and it's only about five to seven minutes away from my apartment that I live at in Silverglade Village. So that is why I have moved barns. And the second part is the new horse. Some of you may remember my old horse, Nito, who injured himself, and so I ended up giving him to my old instructor to be a lesson pony, but that did mean that I would need a new full-time eventer, because although Flash is an amazing pony, unfortunately, he just can't go up to the level that I need, so I decided to start horse shopping, and I found Bramble, who is a 14-3, 15 hand, seven year old halflinger gelding. He's a really cool color as well, I'm not really sure what you'd call it, but um, my plans with him are to go up to novice, and then hopefully compete in Jorvik eventing. So working as an equine nutritionist around Silverglade means that I make sure the hay is in good quality and I can help people find the correct feed for their horses so if someone is looking to change feed and wants to consult a professional I am someone to ask so here you can see just the first stages of the grain and feed and then here's the hay all rolled up into barrels and then as you can see the bales are then put into hay nets for horses to eat. So now that we've spoken a bit about my work, I thought I'd show another side of it. So this was a horse that was brought to the DIY yard and he was needing a new feed because he'd just been imported from Spain and he obviously had to change feed so i was taking a look at him and i was able to find feed that would work for him and his owner once my work is done i'm able to get bramble ready to ride If you follow my Instagram, which is cherrygate underscore eventing, you know a bit more about Bramble already, 
and I do have a dressage saddle for him, but on our hack today, I just tacked him up in his jumping one. As you can see, we met up with a friend along the way, and he was a really good boy, so let me know what videos you want to see in the future. Please like and maybe subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!